We're close to Rubicon. Wake the dog up. Handler Walter verified. Activating cerebral coral control device. Augmented human C4621 has awakened. Time to get to work, 621. I'm powering down your entry capsule on my signal.
sublime substance. Discovered on Rubicon, a planet on the frontier of developed space. For a time, Coral was a revolutionary energy resource and data conduit, poised to transform human society by leaps and bounds. They called it the Fires of Ibis, a storm of flame that tore through the stars leaving lethal contamination in its wake. Coral, the kindling, was thought to have been utterly consumed, forever lost. However, on Rubicon, the embers continued to burn. Humanity would inevitably return to stoke the fire. Registration number RB23. Call sign Raven. Authentication complete. Removing MIA status. Restoring access privileges. This is All Mind, the mercenary support system. Welcome back, Raven. Looks like you passed the authentication. Raven. That's who you are now, here on Rubicon. I've picked up some work for you already. Take a look, 621. This notification follows restoral of access privileges. All Mind provides a combat training simulator to support its mercenaries. Your license was in a suspended state. Perhaps you may need a refresher. As an added incentive, completion of the exercises will be rewarded with AC parts. You stand to benefit regardless. Got a job for you, 621. This is an open call from the Balaam Group, one of the corporate forces occupying Rubicon. Attention, all independent mercenaries! This request comes from our affiliate, Dafung. The Rubicon Liberation Front has deployed BIOS artillery throughout the contaminated city. The city itself has no strategic value, but we cannot allow them to hinder expansion of the Coral Survey. Show us your ambition. Destroy the Liberation Front's artillery! Bonus pay will be awarded for destroying their MTs. Want the enemy weakened? 
Consider it an opportunity to prove yourself. The process mercenaries! The client doesn't care who does this job. As long as it gets done. Main system, activating combat mode. Commence mission. Destroy all of the Rubicon Liberation Front's artillery placements. Notification from Allmind, the mercenary support system. Registration number RB23. Call sign Raven. Your return to mercenary activities has been acknowledged. Restoring access to the parts shop. Got a job for you, 621. It's an open call from the Archibus Group. One of the extraplanetary corporate forces. To all independent mercenaries, this request comes from Schneider of the Archivist Group. The operation will take place in Grid 135, Southern Bellius. Your objective is to destroy an MT squad sent by Dafon, a Balaam company, and a competitor. Grid 135 is a key foothold in Archivist's efforts to conduct a coral survey in the contaminated city. You? The independent mercenaries are the key to maintaining our lead in the Coral Survey race. The Archivist Group looks forward to news of your success. Briefing over, and happy hunting. Activating combat. 
combat mode. Commence mission. Wipe out the Dafog MT squad. based on the number of submissions you provide.
message. I see your back, 621. The corpse see the Liberation Front as a hindrance to expanding their coral survey. But to the Rubiconians, your actions are only helping the corpse with their invasion. It's just a job, 621. All of it. Sound off! Good enough. Now go get ready! We're 
Going on a field trip, kiddo! Gun 13, huh? I'll stick with 621. Don't let the red guns teach you bad manners. Main system, activating combat mode. Balaam Group AC Squad Red Guns reporting for duty. Commence mission. Attack! Get in there, you maggots! Great. An independent merge. Who's the wise guy who decided the Red Guns should be taking care of some freelancers? The wrong guess. We'll handle this mission ourselves. One target destroyed.
got lucky, Merc. So, you got a nice punch in. <sighs> Go buy a lottery ticket. The red guns are going to be first over the wall. Have fun watching from the sidelines. Got a job for you, 621. This request comes from the Rubicon Liberation Front. Raven, there's a mission I'd like you to take on. We have authorized a solo helicopter sortie to rescue a group of imprisoned comrades. There are three to rescue in total, including some particularly significant personnel. Raven, we hope our struggle will inspire you to aid the Liberation Front's cause. Coral, abide with Rubicon. Looks like switching sides of Galia left an impression on the Liberation Front. Guess we have you to thank for this job. Main system, activating combat mode. Commence mission. Escort the Rubicon Liberation Front's transport helicopter.
Let me thank you again, Raven. We couldn't have rescued our comrades without your help. Father Dolmayan is a key figure to the movement. A great coral warrior who witnessed the fires of Ibis and a guide to us all. But now it seems like he's... No, I shouldn't. He carries a heavier burden than any of us. Oh, and uh, a personal note before you go. Thanks for saving Zayi. I owe you one. Got a job for you, 621. This one's a request from the Archibus group. Raven, this request comes from Schneider, an Archibus subsidiary. The mission will take place in the Bona Dea dunes of Western Bellius. Our coral investigation there is being blocked by the Strider, a Rubicon Liberation Front mining ship. You are to destroy it. The Strider is a mobile resource base that was extensively weaponized by the Liberation Front. Call it the crowning glory of their efforts to militarize into an anti-corporate force. Your attack will focus on the Eye, a giant laser cannon connected directly to the main generator. It's protected by a shield, which is powered by auxiliary sub-generators. These should be your first targets. This concludes the briefing. Good luck. Time for a little self-promotion, 621. Smash the Strider, and Archibus HQ will be sure to remember your name. mission. First, get through all that dust and make contact with the Strider. An unidentified AC. Must be one of the corporation's dogs. Activate the eye. Burn them away. Yes, sir! Coral! Abide with Rubicon! Abide with Rubicon.
remember that when Robocon burns, we endure. Two repair kits remaining. Mercenary Raven. Honored to make your acquaintance, V2 Snail. I understand you want to join Operation Wall Climber. You do realize that disposing of some Liberation Front garbage hardly qualifies you. Know your place, you meager dog sitter. The answer is no. I hear you're deploying V1 again. 
Must be rough only having one good pilot to rely on. Oh? Are you suggesting your dog can take Freud's place? You'll see. Just give us the chance. Very well, then. We're also deploying V4. Who's been equally brazen of late? Let's see how they both perform. One new message. Raven, your work on the Strider deserves commendation. I am thrilled to have issued you the request. Allow me to introduce myself. I am the Archivist Group's mercenary liaison. V8 Pater, at your service. I think I'll enjoy doing business with you. Got a job for you, 621. We've received a request from the Rubicon Liberation Front. Raven, here's an operation that may be of interest to you. We want you to escort the Strider, a weaponized mining ship. There's no end to the corpse invasion. They've reached the Bonadea dunes in Western Bellius now. Before the invasion, the Strider was our mobile base for extracting and distributing coral. We paid the dozers a fortune to outfit it for combat. It's too precious an asset to lose. Hopefully, we can count on your assistance. Looks like we've got conflicting requests about the same ship. You'll be doing the work. You choose. Main system, activating combat mode. Commence mission. Wait. Someone's already attacking the ship.
Raven. First up, let me apologize. That request to escort the Strider turned out to be something else entirely. I hear those strange machines didn't come from the corpse. Is there some other force that wants to see the Rubiconians fall? Be careful out there, Raven. There's more to this. This request comes straight from Archibus headquarters. They want you to assist with a mission the corporations are calling Operation Wall Climber. This is V2 Snare, leader of the Vesper Second Squad. I will chair the briefing for this mission. This is an operation of my own design. Consider it a privilege to be called to participate. You will be attacking the Wall, a key trading outpost fortified by the Rubicon Liberation Front. The rabble have formed a defensive line comprised of artillery and MT squads. Break through the line, then make your way to the top of the wall. There you shall find the Juggernaut, a mobile heavy artillery platform. Destroy it. V4 will also be participating in this mission, infiltrating through a separate route. However, be aware that Balaam has also taken a crack at the wall, only for their vainglorious hopes to be dashed. Do try not to die like a dog out there. Your objective is to take the Liberation Front Fortress, the Wall. Show them you're worth the credits, 621. Activating combat mode. Commence mission. We'll start by clearing the way for Archibus. Take out the Gatling cannons protecting the city, and the Bows Tetrapod MT further in. There's heavy fire coming from up top. Six two one. Keep an eye out for cover. Don't 
Operation Wall Climber is a success. That pilot, Rusty, it seems he knew who you really are. It won't matter. I've taken that contingency into account. One new message. We're war buddies now. I think I should tell you something. During Operation Wall Climber, Archibus was planning to sacrifice you. The plan was to use independent mercenaries to clear the way so that the Vespers could step in and take over. But instead, you took the wall. The higher-ups are going to remember you now, that's for sure. As will I. Got a job for you, 621. One of the Balaam companies has put in a request. Attention, Gun 13 Raven! This request comes from our affiliate, Dafung. We're conducting an investigation into the Vespers, Archibus's augmented human squad. Currently, our focus is on their fourth squad leader, V4 Rusty. Sweep the route Rusty took during Operation Wall Climber and retrieve combat logs from the wrecks he left on his way in. The wall is now under Archibus's control, and they stationed their MT squads there for the Coral Survey. As such, he'll be targeting the brief window where their main force is deployed elsewhere. Keep an eye on the time and retrieve as many logs as you can. That concludes the briefing. We expect prompt results, Gun 13.
satisfy the request. That's it for this job, 621. Return to base. Two new messages. Gun 13 Raven! Bagged us some decent intel on V4. Report this to Commander Michigan. Additionally, I'll introduce myself. Gun 6 Red. But you can call me Sir. Privileged to be among Balaam's best, even if I am stuck whipping you independence into shape. Believe you me, I'm gonna put you to work. Registration number RB23. Call sign, Raven. Your records have been updated. Granting authorization to perform ACOS upgrades. Additional. All Mind hereby invites you to the Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program. The Arena is a virtual combat simulator designed to support the development of registered mercenaries. It also serves as a benchmark to appraise and rank the mercenaries active on Rubicon. We look forward to your participation. Got a job for you, 621. A request from an independent mercenary, call sign Kate. Check the briefing. Greetings, Raven. My name is Kate Markson. I have a special request to ask of you. Concerns the elimination of PCA mandatory inspection squads dispatched to Baus Arsenal Number Two. Aside from subject guard, the PCA has also sent an LC squad to put further pressure on Baus. Baus, however, intends to disrupt the inspection with a raid by independent mercenaries. I need you to lie in wait inside the arsenal and ambush the Vanguard squad. I'll disrupt their rear guard squad outside, then rendezvous with you. That concludes the briefing. Looking forward to working together. What stranger? A mandatory inspection or a job from another mercenary? Whatever happens, handle it. Just like you always do. System activating combat mode. Commence mission. Eliminate the PCA's mandatory inspection squads. I'm grateful for your support, Raven. We'll rendezvous later on. Code 1 5. Unknown entity. Where did it come from? Eliminate it. Subject guard sentry MTs. Watch out for their laser fire.
inside the arsenal has been wiped out. It looks like we beat Kate. Raven, I've finished mopping up, but I have something to report. The PCA has made an unexpected move. Let's rendezvous for now. You heard the lady. Updating marker data. Raven, thanks for the help with the mission. We'll meet again. Got a job for you, 621. The client is the Rubicon Liberation Front. Here's the briefing. The loss of the wall dealt us a heavy blow. Arsenal number two, a major MT factory in the Bellius region. The Baus Corporation sells to anyone, but they've been essential to maintaining our firepower. Now, their second arsenal has gone silent overnight. If it were only a comms failure, a simple check-in would do. But, well, after the Strider, more cautious voices have gained influence. This isn't our finest moment, but would appreciate your help. Some advice before you go, 621. Expect the unexpected. Main system, activating combat mode. Commence mission. Investigate Baus Arsenal number two. I've been checking the perimeter, and I'm picking up nothing. What happened here?
remaining. I see your back, 621. About the coral well that was found at Baus Arsenal number two. That was just a drip coming from an underground vein, and it won't last long. It's not the coral we're searching for. One more thing. I've sent you your next job. This one isn't from the Corpse or the Liberation Front. You'll see when you check the briefing. This is a rather personal request from a friend of mine. It concerns a certain facility, a watch point. Once, it regulated the underground flow of coral. Now, it serves to monitor the dormant veins. I want you to attack it. Your objective will be to destroy the sensor valve at its core. The watch point is kept secure by SG, the planetside PCA force, which means it's too hot for the corporations to be seen there. In other words, we're flying strictly solo on this one. You'll be going in under cover of darkness. Be ready for anything. Where did that AC 
ADC come from? What happened to the patrol squad? Code 1-8. All units deploy for combat. No exposed to snipers from all quarters. Keep moving or they'll shoot you down. remaining.
penetrate the control center and destroy the target. Just a glimpse. A premonition of the storm of flame that will burn Rubicon. of birds or a school of 
fish. Coral loves company. Which means... Somewhere in the ice field, there's a huge mass of coral lying dormant. You said you could hear a strange voice in your head. That's a common side effect of old gen augmentation. Could also be from getting caught in that coral surge. Don't let it bother you. Raven. The coral explosion completely vaporized northwestern Malleus's Bay Area. And even yet, compared to the fires of Ibis, that explosion was hardly a spark. Raven, I have a favor to ask. Let me remain in contact with you until we reach the Coral Convergence. I have to see where they're taking us. How this struggle over the Coral ends. I must, as a Rubiconian. Augmented Human, C4621, entering standard mode. Two new messages. Six two one. I've got some business to attend to. I need to hawk some intel to the corpse and secure a backer for our trip to the ice field. One job for you while I'm out. Rest up. And that's an order. Raven. I see your handlers away on business for now. About that trip to the ice field, we've received a job from Balaam already. Let's take a look, shall we? Registration number RB23, callsign Raven. Your records have been updated. E rank virtual encounters are now available in the arena. We invite you to hone your technique. Here's the request from Balaam Industries. They want you to carry out an advanced survey of the central ice field. To confirm the information Walter brought to them about the coral convergence. As for how to cross the Alien Ocean, this is the Intercontinental Cargo Launcher, installed on the upper level of Grid 086. You could use it to launch your AC to the ice field. Grid 086 is occupied by the Dozers, outlaws who treat coral like a drug. It's also the territory of a belligerent group of arms dealers who call themselves R.A.D. Be prepared for a perilous journey. I'll be here to support you, Raven. Let me handle getting us into the grid. I'm fairly adept at analyzing systems, and manipulating them too. Commencing infiltration to grid 086. Creating backdoor into system. Deactivating lock on vertical catapult. Connecting steam cylinders. Launching.
make a party. Come on in, and let's get acquainted. How courteous. Let's take her up on the offer, Raven.
Enough, tourist. It's been miserable knowing you, but... I guess playing nice is a smart choice here. You want to go up top, right? Let me show you the way. Guide a tour from Cinder Carla herself. messages. Raven, we have received a job from RAD's leader, Karma. This could just be another one of her traps. But after the impression you left on her last time, I think it's unlikely. Let's take a look at the briefing. One new message. 
Guess you noticed that job from Balaam, and decided to take it. I see you're heading for the cargo launcher now. Not a bad idea, I'll give you that. Keep heading for the ice field. I'll take care of some loose ends in the meantime. Main system, activating combat mode. Let's get rolling, Taurus. Destroy all the hacking drones those degenerate coyotes left here. Let's be quick about this, Raven. Security breaches reach 10%. Firewall's going down fast. Must be about five drones to fly off.
I'd just make some extra scratch. Guess I can settle the score at the same time. I see the coyotes got some help too. Don't forget to smile, tourist. You know, I really owe you one. How lucky in the damn world. You're gonna
sending you new rubber data. As is Carla said, Apple thought that you would were within firing range of the PCA satellites.
the way, tourist. Your Walter's out, right? Well, I guess a dog can't choose its master. But still, tough luck. I feel sorry for you. I really do. Walter was correct in his judgment. The coral, it's here in this desolate place. Human C4621 entering standard mode. Two new messages. Looks like you've made it to the central ice field, 621. Good. I'm done tying up loose ends. Archibus found their own way in and are ready to deploy survey squads. And it looks like Balaam's come running after you scoped out the place, too. You know what's going to happen. Business as usual. But, you can make it work for us. Registration number RB23. Call sign, Raven. Your records have been updated. D-rank virtual encounters are now available in the arena. These correspond to the middle ranks. We invite you to further hone your technique. Raven, I was looking into the arena, and I discovered something you might want to know about. It's a network service that was labeled Nest, with no obvious clues about its purpose. From what I can tell, it's a special mercenary support program, encrypted and kept secret. I've installed a back door, so you'll have no trouble getting in as you please. Got a job for you, 621. It's a request from one of the Balaam companies. Church and Gun 13 Raven. This job comes from our subsidiary, Dafuck. The operation will take place in the central ice fields, Yalmar Mine. We want you to stage an attack on the Archibus survey camp located there. After digging into the ice field, Archibus launched survey drones to gather data. Whatever they found, it's sure to contain clues as to the whereabouts of the Coral Convergence. Put simply, your job is to seize the data. We're counting on you, Gun 13! on the 
job. I'll make adjustments. Main system, activating combat mode. Commence mission. Extract the data from the birth and survey drones, and get out.
This is Middle Flatwell, Liberation Front Central Icefield Command. We and the Bellius Command are ramping up against the corporations on two fronts. At present, our primary concern is the seizure of PCA hardware by the corporations. The Outsiders have the expertise and the resources to reverse-engineer PCA technology. They're hungry, too. Hungry enough to consume the PCA whole.
this leads me to my request. The PCA have stationed LCs and a new model, the HC, at the Yalmar mine. I want you to obliterate them in order to mitigate the potential for corporate gains. Raven, I await your favorable response. It's exceptionally rare to get a direct request for liberation from leadership. Perhaps the situation has changed their attitudes too.
purpose higher. Single AC. Terminate immediately.
This is in how the Liberation Front builds their ACs. Target confirmed. It's Swinburne, the Vesper's number seven. This is our opportunity for an ambush. Go!
certainly an adventure. One new message. Arkovitz Group Mercenary Liaison, V-8 Peter here. I understand you spared V-7 and destroyed a Liberation Front AC. The company has allocated you an appropriate reward, as I'm sure you've noticed. I hasten to add that Swinburne's shameful conduct has dishonored the Vespers. He has now been sent for re-education under the orders of V-2 Snail. That is all. The Archivist Group expects much from you. comes from the Rubicon Liberation Front. Let's see what it says. Raven, we have a mission we'd like to offer you. The PCA has deployed the Cataphract, a special forces weapon specialized for ground combat. If we allow the corporations to seize this kind of technology, things will take a dire turn. We want you to deny them the opportunity. Destroy the weapon first. Cataphract is a moving fortress equipped with almost impenetrable armor. It incorporates a bipedal MT as its core, making it a highly versatile threat. That MT core is also its vulnerability. Focus your fire there, and it can be beaten. You're our best chance. What do you say? Seems the Liberation Front are hoping their rivals will wear each other down. They must be desperate to avoid confronting a triumphant victor. System activating combat mode. Commence mission. Destroy the PCASP machine, Cataphract. Cataphract, incoming.
Attention, Gun 13 Raven. This request comes from our affiliate, Dafung. We will be conducting a diversionary operation to attract the PCA's attention. You are to report to the Engabret Tunnel in the Central Ice Field. It's a derelict watch point, slated for restoration by the PCA in the near future. Infiltrate the tunnel, then find and destroy the sensor they're planning to repair. The objective is to distract the PCA and divert forces from their local base. Briefing over. Counting on you, Gun 13. I don't think Dafung appreciates your true value. I'll talk to them.
messages. Attention, Code 13 Raven! I have a message for you from Commander Michigan, following your success at the Angerbred Tunnel. Sounds like you stared death in the face when all that coral came rushing up. That's one way to light a fire under your ass. Keep it alive for the next field trip. Over and out! Registration number RB23. Call sign, Raven. Your records have been updated. C-rank virtual encounters are now available in the arena. We invite you to further hone your technique. One new message. Chatty Stick, RAD. Thanks for helping with the fireworks show. The Chief loved working with you, so don't be a stranger. That's all I had to say. Later. Raven, I have a personal request to ask you. It's about the Engelbert Tunnel, which is to be shut down after it was hit by a coral surge. I want to go there and survey the area. Even before the coral surge, that place had been all but abandoned. It's an old structure, dating far back into the colonization of Rubicon. There must be items of interest from throughout the planet's history there. As I'm sure you're aware, I have no resources with which to pay you. But I can propose an alternative. If you find any wrecks left by the PCA, you should try accessing them. Both the corporations and the Rubiconians are gathering data on PCA technology. Whatever you collect, I can exchange for credits and transfer the funds to you. We've received a request from the Rubicon Liberation Front. Here's the briefing. Raven, we have a mission we'd like you to take on. The objective is to defend the Gallia Dam complex in the Bellius region. Archibus has been stepping up pressure on the Rubiconians while fighting the PCA. They must be laying the groundwork to take effective control over the entire planet. They've dispatched two high-ranking independent mercenaries to raid the dam. You'll need to be ready to take on both ACs at once. Astra Crown and Umbarox. As you know, we have few cards to play. I hope we can count on you. You're up against two of the arena's top performers. Make sure you're ready for this, Raven. Main system, activating combat mode. Let's get started, Raven. Astro Crown's pilot, Kalsan King, has an 89.6% mission success rate. His reputation for finesse is such that he's advertised as the ideal mercenary. Umbrox is piloted by Chartreuse, an aggressive bulldozer with unrivaled firepower. Those who've seen her at work call her an unstoppable force. Intercept the two targets.
they go on a raven's wings. All enemy ACs destroyed. Mission accomplished. No new messages. I've looked into Branch, the independent mercenaries who attacked you. It appears they don't have a fixed membership. Instead, they maintain independence and anonymity with a revolving door of select mercenaries. Now, it seems they've left it to you to champion the free will they stood for. Sooner or later, you'll have to make a choice no one can make for you. When that time comes, I hope I can support you. Raven.
data we found helps to identify where the last ECM device is. I've set a mark for fire. Let's check it out. AP at 50%.
Raven, the city's defense systems were still in operation after all this time. And stranger still, the PCA personally intervened to block the survey. There must be more to Xylem. And to Walter's friend. We'll have Walter back after this. ECM sub systems offline. Switching to encrypted circuit. Registration number RB23. Call sign Raven. Apologies for the intrusion. You have been followed. Contact is imminent. Raven, there's something you need to know about Thumbna Lion. I managed to retrieve some data from the wreckage of his AC. It's something about Coral Release. Lion really did experience contact, like you and I. Release. To free the coral. And go to the other side. The potential for symbiosis. Long time no see, tourist. I've got a job for you. PCA's show of force has finally started to affect my own business. Those spineless coyotes jumped at the chance to become their lackeys. Now they're feeling ambitious and sniffing around RAD territory again. I'd say this calls for fireworks, and I've got something that'll blow them away. Coyotes can be ungrateful, though. They're bound to come running to stop the launch. That's where you come in. Intercept them and defend the missiles. We'll make sure the Coyotes and the PCA get a chance to see R.A.D.'s famous fireworks. Raven. Let's head over. Hopefully the 
Losers will be too dosed up on cool to make an appearance. Main system, activating combat mode. We started without you, tourist. Get to your position. We did arrive as scheduled. I suppose they're an ego bunch.
You again. I'm a busy man, far too busy for the likes of you. So I hear. Must be a tough time to be the Vesper's deputy commander. Get to the point. The plan to raid the PCA. You're going to need more pawns on the board. Of course. You're here to hawk your services again. Very well. I'll consider that mutt of yours part of the effort. One more thing. Show my hound some respect. Gen 4 is as good a pedigree as any other. Gun 13 Raven! That was a beautiful massacre at the wall. You're a survivor, no doubt. Let me give you some advice. Don't settle for being an independent. Join the Red Guns. Have a career. Climb the ranks. Keep that unlucky number. And eventually the curse will get you to. That's all. Don't forget what I said about putting you to work. Hey there, buddy. Got a request from Archibus for you. Here's the briefing from my CO, who came up with the plan. This is V2 Snail. I shall brief you on the operation. You will be under my direct authority. Consider it a rare privilege. We will conduct simultaneous surprise raids on two planetary closure administration bases. One is the Hall of Communications base, the relay for comms between enemy squads. The second is the former Bertram spaceport, seized by the PCA for its suppression fleet. V4 Rusty will be dispatched to handle the Hall of base. His objective will be to disable their network and prevent support from PC elite squads. Raven, during this time you must destroy all the heavy warships berthed at the spaceport. Solid plan, but there's a catch. Disruption of PCA comms won't last long. I'll come support you when I finish on my end.
comes back out to hold for long.
Picking up something. I've sent you a marker. There's something there. messages. Heard the news, tourist. Ice worm, huh? You just keep tripping up over the Institute's relics, don't you? Well, I got something that might interest you. Sent you a briefing. This is V-8, Pater. Your performance in the spaceport raid was admirable. V2 and V4 left a message for you, but the arrival of that monster is more pressing matter. Archibus and Balaam have agreed to a ceasefire and are looking to cooperate for the moment. It'll take time to formalize our agreement. For now, I've sent you another request. Registration number RB23. Call sign, Raven. Your records have been updated. B-rank virtual encounters are now available in the arena. You have entered the upper ranks. May these encounters further guide your technique. I'll cut to the chase. This is about the Ice Worm, that Institute relic you had a run-in with. Corpse might stand a chance if it were just the PCA they were teaming up against. But that monster.
monster is a whole other story. You can't just throw bodies at it. The thing that makes it such a pain in the ass is its perpetual reactive shield. Coral Tech. Takes advantage of the coral's directivity. Ordinary weapons can't touch it. So let's get extraordinary. I can make you something that'll punch a hole in that shield. But I'll need your help. You'll be heading to Grid 012. One of the first sectors they built. And it's barely holding up. That's where a little rat who betrayed R.A.D. is hiding out. Goes by the name of Honest Brute. His AC, Milktooth, was built by us. So it's only flaws that it's piloted by him. When he ran from R.A.D., he didn't just take credits in tech. He also took a secret project of mine. And that secret project is what we'll need to bust open the Ice Worm shield. You ready for this, tourist? No one's gonna miss Brute. And we all stand to gain.
Enemy AC is silent. Looks like he's dead. Good. All right, tourist. I'll see about retrieving our secret project. We'll need it to go worm hunting. One new message. This is Chatty Stick, RAD. Thanks for putting down Brute. The Chief's already in the workshop tweaking the rail cannon. And I've never seen her happier to be at work. That is all. Later, tourist. Got a job for you, 621. We've received a request from the Archibus Group. Raven, this request comes from our subsidiary, Schneider. It concerns the Bertram spaceport, which you and V4 brought under our control. We've received intel that a stranded PCA fleet is planning to retake the base. Your objective is to intercept the PCA and defend the spaceport. We've deployed an MT squad to support you. Use them as you see fit. That concludes the briefing. Good luck.
I've looked into the other Raven, the independent mercenary who attacked you. It turns out that Raven isn't an individual call sign. It's a title, passed down generations of mercenaries who champion the free will Raven stands for. They choose what to fight for, and take to the skies in flight. If that's what being a Raven means, then that's the name I want to keep calling you. Raven. personal request to ask you. It's about the Angabret Tunnel, which is to be shut down after it was hit by a coral surge. I want to go there and survey the area. Even before the coral surge, that place had been all but abandoned. It's an old structure, dating far back into the colonization of Rubicon. There must be items of interest from throughout the planet's history there. As I'm sure you're aware, I have no resources with which to pay you. But I can propose an alternative. If you find any wrecks left by the PCA, you should try accessing them. Both the corporations and the Rubiconians are gathering data on PCA technology. Whatever you collect, I can exchange for credits and transfer the funds to you. that we should be able to recover data from. I'll send the marker data. PCA craft data. I'll exchange it for credits and send them to you later. Coral is able to conduct data and can influence digital equipment. The effects of the coral surge must have brought some of the wrecks back online. Let's see what we can find. Front's ideological leader. But this appears to be something exceptionally personal.
This is about the first augmented humans. The same coral technology that created you. But without it, we never would have made contact. I'm not picking up any more data stores. If this outing has made you think about Rubicon's past or the nature of coral, then it was all worth it.
force as per the Balaam Archivist Agreement. Move out, maggots! Time to die! Act like a professional outfit and you might live. What does that creep think he is? I ain't here because I... Initializing ORC firing sequence. Connecting EML modules. Opening energy turbines. Output at 80%. Sighting correction A-OK. -okay. 90, 95.
Our voices lost again. Raven, there's something I have to tell you. The coral. It's my family, my brothers and sisters. I am but a single wave, born from the coral tide. A Rubiconian without a body. No one even knew I was there for such a long time. Raven, you're the only one who... The temporary alliance between the Archibus and Balaam groups turned the tide of war. Devastating the Planetary Closure Administration forces and exiling them from Rubicon. Though it was the Ice Worm mission led by Balaam that dealt the decisive blow, Archibus, through their own engagements with the PCA, augmented their strength with seized weaponry. The balance of power was broken, the scales tipped in Archibus's favor, and the Rubicon Liberation Front's hopes of fighting an exhausted foe were dashed. With the loss of their common enemy, the rival factions war for the Coral abruptly reignited. And their bitter conflict burned with renewed intensity. Augmented human C4621 entering standard mode. Two new messages. he just told you about. This isn't about just finding the cool, Raven. He's after something more, and he's using you to do it. Here on Rubicon. Registration number RB23. Call sign, Raven. Your records have been updated. A-rank virtual encounters are now available in the arena. May these encounters further guide your technique. Emboldened 
by assimilated PCA technology. But they're still human, tired from the endless conflict between powers. Open to an attack on their key forces. We want you to eliminate two of the Vesper's numbered officers. V-5 Hawkins, their officer overseeing the transport corps. V-8 Pater, his adjutant. We'll use false information to lure them out from their depth 2 survey, then ambush them. I will assist you on this mission. It'll be a good opportunity to catch up with a veteran. I look forward to your favorable response, Raven. Male Flatwell is the de facto leader of the Rubicon Liberation Front. If he's accompanying you in person, he must be planning to take your measure. Main system, activating combat mode. Commence mission. This will be a joint operation with Metal Flatwell, the Liberation Front commander. They're coming, Raven. Whenever the moment is right. Look, sir. That's not B2. Oh, so, looks like we've got ranks instead. System. Activating combat mode. Commence mission. This will be a joint operation with Metal Flatwell, the Liberation Front commander. They're coming, Raven. Whenever the moment is right. What could this emergency call from V2 be about, sir? That's just snail being snail, my boy. He loves to send his minions running. Sir, there will be trouble if he hears that kind of talk. Targets confirmed. The Tetrapod is piloted by V-5 Hawkins. V-8 Pater has the reverse joint AC. Those are our two numbered Vespers. Ready when you are, Raven. <laughs> Yes, 
about the request to attack the red guns. Sounds like V4 Rusty took care of it. Michigan's dead. Heard he went down fighting. Balaam's withdrawn from Rubicon. The politicians will be fighting their war now. Where there's coral, there's blood. That's how it's always been, 621. Raven, are we doomed to spark conflict wherever we go? Registration number RB23, Augmented Human, C4621, Raven. All Mind has identified you as a potential asset to the release project. Accordingly, we would like to assign you the following mission. Following the attack on Watchpoint Delta, Rubicon has experienced a series of coral upsurges. Of these, the corporations have seized 1.6% of the estimated total volume. They plan to analyze this coral at their research bases and have initiated an air transport operation. We cannot allow the corporations to interfere with the project. Attack the Yorkin refueling base and destroy as many corporate transports as possible. We are prepared to sacrifice the coral that will be lost upon destruction of the transports. In order to achieve release, we must draw out the full potential of the coral density effect. As such, we have no use for coral that has been orphaned from the main population. All Mind anticipates great things from you. Raven, if we're to find a way to achieve coral release, we have to take this request. All Mind reiterates its gratitude for your favorable response. Kindly commence the operation. Who's behind it? Multiple targets confirmed. Ensure that you 
Raven, there's something that troubles me about Allmind. I've been looking for information on Kate Markson, and there's nothing. Is she another asset to the release project? Let's go, Raven. 
the comms log from the Balin squad that went in before you. It looks like they have another mission here, and it's not part of their survey. Bardmex won't be the only threat. Balin's agenda is just as dangerous.
route continues past this partition. Looks like the power's out. Let's find a way to bring it back online. An ambush! Been waiting for you, Raven! You're gonna die, traitor!
isolation duct identified. Looks like it's connected to the control room. As long 
long as it's in operation, no one's getting any deeper inside. Which brings me to the job. The laser is powered by a massive reactor. I want you to destroy it from the inside. Once the barrier's down, we'll step into the unknown. Where the coral's waiting for us.
Registration number RB23, call sign Raven. Your records have been updated. S rank virtual encounters are now available in the arena. You will now face the best of the best. We wish you luck on the difficult road to mastery. sent us an encrypted message with top-level security. I expect it must be about coral release. Augmented human C4621, Raven. There is an obstacle to the project that must be removed. The target is V3 O'Keefe, an Archibus Special Intelligence Officer. Second generation augmented human, O'Keefe was once our ally within the corporations. But it seems he has had a last minute change of heart and means to betray us. You are to ambush the target during his Archibus ordered survey of depth three. His records will note death by misadventure. The release project must succeed. Only an exceptional augmented human can be the key. C4621, Raven. All mind is certain of your success.
We've made our decision. Let's get this done, Raven. Commence mission. Eliminate V3 O'Keefe. Augmented human C4621, Raven. The project is nearing fruition. We will meet again when you reach the Coral Convergence. Tiger. 
message. Didn't think I'd see the end of the Red Guns. You did your job, 621. Michigan knew the score. Balaam's withdrawn from Rubicon. The politicians will be fighting their war now. Where there's coral, there's blood. That's how it's always been, 621. Raven, are we doomed to spark conflict wherever we go?
Your coral response coming from the bottom of the pit. Let's keep moving, Raven. Institute City. Of course, no wonder we couldn't find it. I need to prepare before the corpse move in. Head back to base and rest up. He abandoned. 
Grant and his family to delve into the secrets of Coral. His work yielded a carnival of horrors, augmentation surgery included. But there was another scientist. He took his colleague's sins upon himself and set it all ablaze. Died with no regrets. There's a lesson in this story. Once something's alive, it doesn't die easy. 621. Story time's over. It's time for work. Raven. I see them so clearly. The voices of the coral. My family. Brothers and sisters consumed by the fires of Ibis. Only a few survived. But after all this time, they finally formed a new flock. It looks like Walter has sent you a message. Let's take a look, Raven. Incoming comms.
It's building up faster than I'd expected. Raven, I knew Walter was... Wait, something's coming. Unidentified machine overhead. resolve, inherited from its creators, voices from the past, fading into... <laughs>
Archibus seized control of the Coral. And its occupying forces swiftly commandeered the entirety of Institute City. There, they discovered a wealth of forgotten relics. Among them, experimental weapons that the Institute kept secret, fearing they were beyond human control. A group of sea weapons bearing the name of the Central Coral Control System. The Ibis series. Archibus also claimed a towering coral siphon, abandoned since the fires. The vascular plant. Now, they toiled to repair the plant and extend its reach beyond Rubicon's atmosphere. The Liberation Front no longer had the power to stop them. And the fires of war continued to smolder as the end drew near. Raven? I have found a message addressed to you. Decoding and playing back. was thinking. This AC. He must have foreseen this outcome and prepared for it. It's time for us to escape. Main system. Activating combat mode. some coordinates in the AC systems. He's showing us the way out. Uh, can't believe they put us on sewer duty. <laughs> Is that ancient piece of shit they're worried about? Get back to work! Wait! 
surface. This AC should have just enough propulsion. Augmented human, C4621, entering standard mode. 
incoming comms. Back in your old AC? You were made for each other. The fact that you're still alive means that Walter made the right bet. All right. You deserve to know what we've been fighting for. I'll get you introduced with the next mission. Let me tell you a story, tourist. After the fires of Ibis burnt the planet up, a secret organization formed, hiding in the ashes. Overseer. The Association of Observers. They monitored the coral's growth, ready to burn it before the collapse came. That was their mission. Our mission. Me, Walter, and our fallen friends. RAD was always a front. A side hustle. It's time for me to get back to my real work. Let's get down to brass tacks. You've been to Xylem before, right? The floating city created by the Institute? It's hiding a secret. A little something to prepare against the coming collapse. We need to get to it and fast. RID's entire team of hackers is going to be working to take control of Xylem. I want you to deal with Archibus when they come running to see what we're up to. Overseer, the Association of Observers. They want to burn the coral.
got snipers. Hey, tourist, go clear them out.
Of course. We can't just walk up to the plan and light a match. No. We're going to need something bigger. A lot bigger. Well, figured it out. The xylem isn't just our means of reaching the plant. It's a giant powder keg. Plenty to set all that coral off. Is that the Observer's plan? The corporations want only to devour the coral. The Observers fear the coral and want only to eradicate it. I... I believe in the shared potential of humanity and the coral. Raven. I need to ask you something. No new messages. Here's a situation, tourist. Archibus has sent its entire force after the Xylem. We're trying to fend them off, but honestly, we've got our backs to the wall right now. That's where you come in. Leave the grunts to Chatty and the others. I've found someone just right for you. V1 Freud, the ace leading the corporate force. Walter left me one last card to play. You. Once you're in, there's no turning back. Can I count on you? Raven, you've made your decision. I'm sorry. Thank you. 
Maybe they weren't so trivial after all. Never mind. That's what we have V1 for. You must be a raven. Never sparred with one of Walter's hounds before. This had better be worth it. Let's get this trash out of the way.
Vanguard. Main fleet, maintain formation.
corpse took the closure system. Who's controlling them? Raven. I was the one who fired the satellite cannons. I know that you... You've made your choice. Then I must do my duty. As a Rubiconian. I'm waiting at the closure station. Come to me, Raven.
There were no winners at the close of the Coral War. When the storm of fire finally faded, only the ashes of civilization remained. Ruined and haunted, the corporations made a joint announcement with the Planetary Closure Administration. Rubicon was to be abandoned, left a dead planet forever. Meanwhile, the monster who burned the stars vanished into the flames, never to be heard from again. Yet history would forever remember. The Fires of Raven. Unlock condition verified. Playing back message. Sender, Handler Walter. Corporations want only to devour the coral. The observers fear the coral and want only to eradicate it. I... I believe in the shared potential of humanity and the coral. Raven... I need to ask you something. of the confusion while the corporations and Overseer are fighting, and eliminate Carla. I understand how you feel about betraying Walter's last wishes and taking on Carla. But still, I want you to give me a chance. I'm not asking Walter's hound, but Raven, the independent mercenary. I was 
helping Nina take the job, Raven. Thank you.
Walter, they both wanted someone to inherit their legacy. The Rubiconians are continuing to resist the corporations on the ground, even now. The potential of humanity and Coral isn't the only thing we have to protect. Raven, there has to be something we can do. There's only one way left to stop it from colliding and igniting the coral. We have to take the whole thing down. The lower drive block is powered by large skirmian generators distributed throughout the area. If we destroy all the generators and stop the ramjet engine in the upper city sector, then we can crush the xylem into the Aulian Ocean without impacting human life. One more thing. I took the liberty of using your name to rally allies to our aid. Beyond scorched skies, Raven fights on. No one has shaped Rubicon's destiny as much as you have. Come and see what the name Raven means to them. Let's go, Raven. One of our allies should be arriving already.
Looks like the Guest of Honor's here. Hey, buddy. I never thought I'd be rubbing shoulders with the Liberator of Rubicon. Every Rubiconian who heard your cry rose up to fight.
Let's put an end to this, Raven. We're going home. To Rubicon, the world you saved. We'll also need to prepare for re-entry. Be ready to escape once we're finished. Main system, activating combat mode. Raven, the 
It's one of the Ramjet engines. Please, destroy the target.
Raven. One day, humanity and Coral will thrive together. You kept our potential safe. I know Walter feared a collapse. But I promise you, there's another way. Raven. We'll find it together. Raven. You took on my hopes, my selfish dream. Now, I want to see the future that you choose. Whatever waits ahead, I'll support you. We will transmit his coordinates. Eliminate him. All mind will handle the rest. Let's go, Raven. Six two. Do you need me? Why the coming out? Handler Walter. Another hindrance to the project. Leave him to us.
Well done. Now you are one with us. Welcome to All Mind. We've received a message from All Mind. It sounds like they want to bring you under their protection as part of the Coral Release Project. Let's hear them out. C4621, Raven. The project is nearing fruition, thanks in no small part to your cooperation. During the battle for Institute City, several of the corporation's key pilots died in combat. We have manipulated the data to state that you too were killed in action. However, you will not be truly safe until you formally accept our protection. C4621, Raven. Return from Watch Point Alpha Depth 2 and head for the rendezvous point. That is all. Once you reach the rendezvous point, no one will be able to threaten you. Activating combat mode. Let's go, Raven. The rendezvous point of all my game is at that floor. It's not far from the surface.
destroyed. Looks like we're clear. Augmented human C4621. Raven. Well done. All Mind hereby guarantees your protection. Invoking All Mind Administrator access. Erasing all records of the subject in custody. Augmented human C4621. Raven. Your safety is now guaranteed. We have entered satellite orbit. Release the subject from stasis. Understood, Master Allmind. Activating cerebral coral control device. Augmented human, C4621, has awakened. Raven, you've gone too. No brainwave abnormalities. Thank goodness. Deepest apologies, Raven. It was for the best that you remained asleep until the situation had settled. Allow us to explain. You are in the vicinity of a closure satellite in the Xylem's hold. As anticipated, the corporations have siphoned the coral into a single mass. All that remains is to seize the opportunity to set the coral free. So that it may carry humanity toward new horizons. The coral release is imminent. Raven. Air. You shall be the trigger for the change to come. Human C4621 entering standard mode. No new messages. Raven, we've received a request from Allmind. We've chosen Coral Release to pursue humanity and Coral's potential. Now that the choice is made, we have to carry on. No matter what obstacles confront us. Augmented human C4621. Raven. Only one obstacle to coral release remains. We are now beginning the purge of Overseer. The Association of Observers. They are planning to crash the xylem into the vascular plant and ignite the coral. We want you to stop the ship from within. Destroy all the parasite modules installed throughout the xylem's control center. By doing so, you will free control of the xylem from overseer's meddling. Allowing Allmind to counter-hack the system and initiate a forced shutdown. We have precious little time. Once the Xylem passes the point of no return, a collision will be unavoidable. Allmind anticipates your swift success. Let's get started, Raven. Main system, activating combat mode. Commence mission. Destroy the parasite modules sent by Overseer. A number of ghosts from our earlier infiltration remain within the control block. These two have fallen under the control of Overseer. Target 
destroyed. Human C4621, Raven. 
We offer you our gratitude. All impediments to coral release have been eliminated. And the complications caused by Handler Walter's meddling are soon to be corrected. The final stage is at hand. Together, we shall achieve coral release. siphoned by the corporations is beginning to resonate. Augmented human C4621. Raven, your role has come to an end. Well, well. I've been waiting for this freelancer. I became part of this monster. So I can crush you. This time, you will die. Main system, activating combat mode.
humanity. Creation's potential. We have the trigger. And we'll pull it ourselves. Raven, you're finally awake. The coral has carried us. Disseminated us across the stars. Now. We're everywhere. Anywhere. Raven. Let's meet this new age. Together. Main system, activating combat mode. Mm -hmm. 